digging around in Mary Tennis's barn, we came across some of these blue insulators. And these have been around for a long time. They're a huge collectible pieces. There's actually associations and uh, websites that are dedicated to nothing but these insulators because we have a, a sample, there's probably four different insulators that we found down at Mary's. But there's literally, there's probably five or 600 different kinds. They come in a lot of different colors and a lot of different styles. And, and they're all identified on the insulator themselves. These were made by the Heming Ray Glass Company, which was originated in 1848. Um, it was bought out by another glass company in 1932 during the Depression. But as you can see, this it says it's, in, it's Heming Ray uh, made in the USA, and then there's a number that's imprinted on it. And this one is a Heming Ray number 12. And this is kind of a neat insulator. It was produced from 1890s to the 1940s. And this is a, a two-part insulator. Around this main big collar on top is where the actual telephone or telegraph wire went around. But then this would be in the yard of the farms. And this secondary groove here was where the, actually the drop line went to the house to supply the telephone. This is literally, according to the research I've done, is the most popular. It uh, was produced from 1921 to, to the end of the company in 1966. This is, I it's, yeah, it's a Hemingway 42. But these are very common, and this is what you know a lot of people see around. They just have such a beautiful color and, and different style. And it, it's just a super neat piece. But the neat thing about all these insulators and what we found kicking around even up to Mary's is there's a, a huge backstory to these insulators that actually has a lot to do with the state of Minnesota and rural electrification, which was uh, started in 1933, was part of FDR's New Deal program. Uh, in 1933, obviously the country's in the state of the Depression. So there was Roosevelt put into play uh, the WPC, the CCC, different programs to help stimulate our economy. And part of stimulating our economy was getting electricity out into rural America, which these insulators are, are the, a huge part of that. 